When we acquired Turnabout back in 1985, she had no boarding ladder at all. We tried a number of different kinds of ladders through the years. Those plastic and aluminum ones that hang over the gunnel, rope ladders with plastic treads. None of them really work very well. Turnabout has a shallow dinghy-like hull, and if the ladders hung over far enough for you to get a foot on the bottom rung, they would swing back underneath the hull where you had absolutely no purchase to get back on board. We finally added this ladder. It's from a Catalina 22. It swings far enough down in the water that you can actually get a foot on the lower rung. We also added teak pads to the rungs. Those round metal rungs are murdering your feet. But the most important thing we did was to make the ladder deployable from the water. If you pull on the red lanyard, it releases a hitch pin that allows the ladder to swing down into the water. If you fall overboard, this is about the only way you're going to get back on board. This is a close-up detail of our ladder quick release system. We have two rail clamps here and here attached to the ladder. We have what's called a hitch pin that goes through the two openings in the rail clamp and holds the ladder firmly in place. The lanyard goes down to within reach of the water and you can deploy the ladder by simply pulling on that lanyard and releasing the ladder. Ready? This is a handy piece of hardware we've used on several of our projects. It's called a rail clamp. It'll clamp around any push pit rail, stanchion, or other 1 inch or 7 eighths inch diameter stainless steel tubing you have on your boat. It's two molded pieces of plastic held together with stainless steel screws and nuts. It comes apart very simply, like so. And it comes with bushings so you can fit it to either 7 8 inch or 1 inch diameter tubing. If you like, you can also add an eye strap to the end. We use these to attach bungees and also we use it on our quick release ladder system.